This is the Kotlin Whisperer channel. This channel is your home for all things Kotlin. Everything ranging from Android, JVM, desktop, web, server, and even native libraries. We will get a chance to discuss various topics surrounding all Kotlin multi-platform targets. This advanced Kotlin course is designed for software developers with an interest in Kotlin technologies. Whether you write one or multiple targets of Kotlin, this is the course for you if you're looking to advance your Kotlin knowledge and utilize its powers to increase your productivity when building Kotlin applications. By the end of this course, you'll be able to understand and apply some advanced Kotlin techniques to your developer workflows. The course will cover the following. Advanced Kotlin functions, advanced Kotlin classes, an introduction to build systems, Kotlin generics, reflection and type erasure, delegation, Asynchronous programming with Kotlin coroutines. This will be found in the extended version on Udemy. An introduction to Kotlin multi-platform will also be found in the extended version on the Udemy course. In order to get the most out of this course, you will need to have some Kotlin experience. You should be able to work comfortably with the following. Creation of Kotlin variables and data types. Writing and invocation of Kotlin functions. Creation of classes and objects using class constructors to add and utilize parameters in Kotlin classes. You will also need the following tools during your learning process. A copy of IntelliJ IDEA 2023.1 is the version I'll be using. We'll be running everything on Kotlin 1.9 and the JDK 11. I also always prefer to have a beverage of your choice nearby. Mine happens to be some black tea. To run our examples, you'll need a machine with the following specifications. You're either running Mac OS, Linux, or Windows. Four gigabytes of RAM at the minimum. However, for IntelliJ to work very well, you need at least eight gigabytes of RAM. 125 gigabytes of free storage. Alternatively, you can run all our examples in the Kotlin Playground. You can find this in the URL play.kotlin.org. With all this, you're ready to explore the deep sea of the beautiful Kotlin programming language. See you in episode one.